Hello everybody, I'm Adalberto, your Mr. International Rubber 23, and I'm very excited to introduce you today to our beautiful city of Amsterdam. You may think this is the Rubber Palace, but no, this is the central station and that's where we are starting our tour today. I have two hosts with me, and one is Dennis. Hi everybody, I'm Dennis, alias Rubber Ams, and together we will show you Amsterdam, and we hope you enjoy our tour. And the second city guide for you today is going to be my sesh husband, Dirk. Let's start our tour with some shopping. Actually, all the kinky venues that we have in Amsterdam, or most of them, are on walking distance from the central station. The first shop that we want to visit today, and that's Rob in the Warmoestraat. And we are here at uh, Rob. And Rob is the very first fetish store in Amsterdam. And they have a good selection of rubber, leather, and all the other stuff. And the next stop we're going is the Eagle, which is at the end of the street over here. I'm super excited to be here in the Eagle. That's the place where it all started a year ago when I won the Mr. Rubber Netherlands title. Excuse me. Oh, hello. Hi, we are here at the basement of the Eagle, which is the oldest house of Amsterdam from 1485. And look who I have here with me. It's Karin, Miss Leather Netherlands. Woohoo! And Hans, what's your favorite event here in Amsterdam? That would be the meantime, an all gender play party. I organized together with Raymond. Oh, that's something definitely not to miss. Karin, what's your favorite event? Definitely Leather Pride weekend in Amsterdam. What about rubber? Oh my god, I love you rubber folks, you're so shiny. Oh, thank you. This is the river Amstel, which gives the name to the city of Amsterdam. There are two ways to visit the city, one of course by boat from the water, and the best method of transportation is of course the bike. And did you know that Amsterdam had more bridges than Venice? These are typically Amsterdam toilets, so for those who like water sports, there are facilities everywhere. And I think they're going to be used as well. So we are here in the Kerkstraat, and this is Black Body, one of the king shops of uh, Amsterdam. And it's been here for quite a long time, and it uh, has all kinds of kings. So if you're into leather, or if you're into neoprene, you will find everything you like. But of course, also, they have a lot of rubber. On the same street as Black Body, the Kerkstraat, we also have a very famous club here in Amsterdam, which is Club Church. Let's go there. And now we're in front of Club Church, actually one of my favorite clubs in town. It has theme nights, fetish, sportswear, and it really, church loves all flavors. And after a little bit of clubbing, shall we do some more shopping? Let's go to Mr. B. We are now at Mr. B, and they have quite a decent selection of leather, rubber, and all kinds of kinky stuff. So. Our favorite shop, they have a lot of stuff. Let's go to the Homo Monument, which is really like one minute from here. We have arrived here on the Homo Monument, which is the first monument that commemorates all people that have been persecuted or oppressed due to their homosexuality. This monument was built in 1987, so already 33 years ago. And this monument, as you may see here, is made of actually three big triangles. This, where we stand, is one of them. And the three triangles represent the past, the present, and the future. And the present and the future are on that side, where we often, during the Pride in summer, we have a lot of parties. And just around the corner is the Anna Frank's house. And we're still shopping, now at Gaze and Gadgets. The Amsterdam dealer of Mr. S. Leather San Francisco. And here you can find all kinds of gadgets, birthday cards, flags. And I think after the shopping, shall we have a drink at Brick? It's on the same street, just around the corner. Mm, we really needed a drink after all this walking in town. And we are here at the Bar Brick, and I've here for you the owner. Gerson van Eck, one of the two owners of uh, Bar Brick, here since 14 years in the center of gay Amsterdam. Um, yeah, known for our cocktails. We have about 35 different cocktails on our menu, all um, designed by our 
a wonderful team. Definitely, and it's great parties. And as a matter of fact, they hosted the opening party of the Dutch Rubberman weekend, and we had a lot of fun. So thank you again for hosting us. And the last stop of today is at the web, the bar where the Dutch Rubberman Sunday socials take place. And I'm here for you, Stefan, our Mr. Led in Netherlands. Stefan, what's your favorite event? My favorite event is uh, Pride Amsterdam. It's in the summer and the uh, main event you shouldn't miss is the canal parade. 80 boats floating on the canals and having fun. <laughs>